You think we're gonna beat all these games? It's us. It is we. These boys. Oh, that's just me. All right, so we're gonna. Oh, it's literally <laughs> just you versus the army. Yep. This will be good. What are they shooting at then? So last time we were on this mission. Oh, there is one tank. Okay, I got one some, friend having some issues. Look at all these missiles. Those are missiles. Yeah. How are you supposed Got to beat all these guys? Uh, well, I'm in a tank. So we'll see if... We've been that... playing this game for how long and I'm still like, Vaughn, why are you shooting the good guys? <laughs> oh, why am, I, why am I shooting the rebels? Yeah, I'm yeah. like, wait a minute, aren't those your guys? Just assuming that you're the good guys. Because it's a video game. Okay. Uh, this, let's see, we might actually capture this. I, it's a long shot, but nope. Okay. <laughs> as soon as you get out of the tank. <laughs> Got him. Oh, man. Uh, you told me about something. We won't talk about it on the show. You told me about something very interesting about a... Some spicy stuff? Some spicy stuff, yeah. Yeah, about like a, Yeah, like drama about a person that you... Like a content creator. But uh, I actually wanted to talk about um, pretty much the opposite. Okay. <laughs> like when you... So, so the guy I had talked about, I don't know if it was in this series or another series, is the guy that makes the... The videos videos? About, yeah about like julius caesar uh-huh and uh he he released a video which he only does like every month or so because sure. it takes a long time to create but like he got it was cool because he got a new font new music because he, he kept using the same like royalty free music over and over okay new music new font new editing like way okay, better editing enemy. with like a lot more uh flash and right just like a lot more going on that that like gives up just production value all around yes and it was really cool to like see go on that journey the person you've seen like over and over again and see them like level up I yeah guess, in their production value yeah, that's awesome. Really, really Do you cool. think maybe he got to the point where he was like making some money from his videos and he was able to hire an editor? That's what I kind of well, maybe because it's it's still in the same style, but yeah, it's definitely it's like noticeably the quality is a lot higher. Yeah, and like the attention to to detail and it just seems like a lot more time was spent on it. So maybe he felt like he could spend more time on it. it I don't know if he does it himself. Yeah, could be. But uh, or he could have gotten someone who. Yeah, like you said, helps. Which would be cool to see that he has just Rebel, <laughs> just a guy named Rebel. Yeah, dude. What's that actress's he's not, name? He's Rebel, not to be trifled with. Rebel Johnson. Rebel, Rebel number four. This, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're talking yeah. about. Oh no, the grenade. <laughs> the Wookiee went flying, and so then, then you went. Is flying. everyone just Rebel? Oh, it's probably because they have more. They probably have like more AI profiles than they made names for in this mission so that the AI can cheat. Very what? good. Like every AI rebel or I guess every AI character has like a name. Like a class? No, like that person is like a phantom player, I guess. And like it tracks their stats and everything. So it's like Gnome Carlson or something. Oh, okay. Is like the guy's name. And he can Gnome. switch classes. Yeah. <laughs> Kind of like Noam Chomsky, <laughs> but uh, kind of like him, yeah, <laughs> a little bit, you know, freedom fighter. You know. <laughs> uh, but they, it seems like on this mission they just had, they wanted to make it so hard that they just like just added more AI. Yeah, there's like ah, let's just have 18 extra rebels. Nice. Oh god. So Vaughn, I I have to tell you that you have been, uh, you have been vindicated. I've been vindicated. You got vindicated by some kids. Some kids. Yeah. <laughs> what? So, <laughs> I was I was at work, and uh, oh god! <coughs> right now at what? work, we have. See, like Ty Bodella. That's right. It's that's, like a that's a guy. It's like a fake name. Yeah, but yeah. he but he's like a profile who continues. To, so like, if he dies, he responds as that as the same class, and he can kill you again. Yeah. yeah. So it gives you this feeling that you're like playing online, kind yep. of. Yep. Yeah, I get it. Um. So at work right now, we have an air hockey table. Okay. For people to like come up and mess around with or whatever. Mm -hmm. Just as like an eye catch kind of thing. Um, and so naturally, the the, mo the most common people to sure. come up and play it are little kids. Mm -hmm. They're like, ah, cool! <laughs> yep. You know, 
and they like, feel like they're at an arcade or something. Yeah, yeah, like they're not expecting that. And like I'm not allowed to play it <laughs> while I'm working. <laughs> so like a lot of times people will be like, oh, you want to take me on? You know, some like random dude, and I'll be like, no, <laughs> no, <laughs> like, or yeah. like I can't because uh, you're working, even though I don't yeah. really want to. And so, so naturally, what happens is like the kids will come up, and then I'm just standing there, and I'm just kind of like mm-hmm. watching, and I, I'm not really supposed to do anything. And so I just end up watching a lot of kids play air hockey. Mm-hmm. Well, this brother and sister. Oh God! Did they steal that as soon as you got out of it? No, that's a grenade. As oh. soon as I got out. Uh, so, so this brother and sister came up and they're playing for how, like how old? Uh, the girl was probably like I don't know seven or eight, and then the boy was probably five or six. Okay, seemed pretty close in age, but the girl was definitely. Did you older. see that? All those guys yeah. flying out of there. Yeah, this mission is that that didn't look good. But they're playing against each other, you know, and they're getting the sibling rivalry going, and they're bickering and all this kind of stuff, and. The uh, the girl like lost her paddle or something, mm-hmm. and she had to like walk around the side of the table. And she goes, "Oh, t t t t t t t." She called a timeout by saying "t." Oh, did she? <laughs> and I was like, <laughs> my mind exploded, <laughs> and I was like, "Holy that shit!" Is amazing. And I <laughs> I was having like a physical reaction to it, and they did it like multiple times, mm-hmm. and they both used it, and I was like, "Holy shit!" It's a real thing. Yeah, I'm telling you. But T. I'd, li- I'd literally never. I'd yeah. literally never. But they never did this. They, they never, they did, never did the hand gesture. I think that's that's like where it comes from. I get, I get that that's it. where it comes from because yeah. you're like making a T with mm-hmm. your hands. Like that makes perfect sense. But I'd that, never heard somebody <laughs> I'm say. Really glad that happened. T to call a timeout. And you told that story, mm-hmm. and I was like, that's ludicrous. I've never heard anyone <laughs> say that. And then these random kids said it. That. And I was like, wow, there it is. That is beautiful. So there must be, it must be some like duck, duck, gray duck, Minnesota, yeah, Minnesota thing. Minnesota or, or Midwest kind of thing. Midwest thing that kids elsewhere don't say. Because I feel like if, I feel like if kids in the South said that, I would have heard it at some point mm-hmm. growing up. Right. But literally never heard it. So Vaughn was vindicated, Ooh. ladies and gentlemen. I don't remember what. Yeah, what when did we talk about episode that? or series yeah. that was? But you were talking about playing like capture the flag across <laughs> you and your neighbor's yard. I think you've told that story more than once. Mm-hmm. And that you would say T instead of timeout. Did we lose? I don't know, man. Ugh, I'm not paying attention. <laughs> God, I'm getting <laughs> whooped. Is this mission really hard? Yeah. It seems harder in a different way, though. Yeah. There's just like. It's so that that thing that you capture where you have like the walls around you, it's just like so open and there's all these tanks and stuff. Yeah, all the command posts seems really seem really tough to capture. Yeah. Is that pretty much all you have to do in this mission? Is capture all? I the I think I capture posts? all the ones up the side, and then there's one in the middle that I think I take, and then I have to like storm the pyramid at the top eventually. Okay, you all know the mission. There's the like a there's like a ruins kind of thing. So, uh, May the 4th was Star Wars Day. It was. As it tends to be. <laughs> and, uh, we played a, the cover band played a show mm-hmm. in Excelsior. And it wasn't, it had nothing to do with Star Wars. Mm-hmm. But we all decided that because it was May the 4th, we were all going to wear, like wear Star Wars, Star Wars shirts. Mm-hmm. Um, just as like a subtle nod. Mm-hmm. And, uh, we noticed obviously that there was a lot of other people that were at the event that also had had Star Wars, Star Wars shirts on. Yeah. And we got to talking with these people and I found out that uh, either a friend or a sibling of one of my bandmates Jeez. is in the Minnesota 501st. <laughs> really? Yeah. Wow. Which, if anyone listening is unfamiliar with what that is, it's basically like a local chapter of Star Wars nerds that own Stormtrooper mm-hmm. outfits. So they dress up like Star- Stormtroopers like official stormtrooper outfits mm-hmm. and then they go to like malls <laughs> or like random like you know comic book shops mm-hmm. or whatever to like take pictures with kids and you know do funny stuff or I, whatever. I had friends in uh, high school who went to the renaissance fest in in a group Star of stormtroopers yeah as a group of stormtroopers in like c3po and that's funny <laughs> darth vader 
I mean, I guess people would probably just be like, sure, whatever. Mm -hmm. Go for it. Um, does does the name 501st does that come from this game? Because this we are like this. Yeah, this yeah, is yeah. I don't know against. if it, I don't know if it comes from this game or if this game got it from some like written some like lore. I feel like there's got to be like a, universe thing. like an extended universe book or something. Yeah, that's much older. Because I feel like those chapters were probably cropping up like in the early 80s mm -hmm. when the movies were current and coming out. Well, but specifically, I think the the biggest. Well, maybe yeah, maybe this just fills in like the backstory of like oh they transitioned from the Republic. Yeah, as the yeah. I mean, the five hundred first could have been just a name of a stormtrooper battalion. Mm -hmm. Everything's at before Jesus. they before they put a story <laughs> you to it. Can't even see the command post. Everything's just exploding. Did you see that thing I posted in the in the group yesterday about how some people Ooh. are opening up a like a D and D themed pub? Um. Oh yeah, I did. I didn't. I only saw like the the headline. I didn't see. I didn't read. Have time to read it. It's basically gonna be like the way they described it. So it's gonna be like a like a it's pub tavern. Yeah, it's basically like a pub or a tavern that's th themed like it would be. In like a, you know, a fantasy RPG, um, and then it's also going to have like tabletop games. So yeah. it sounds like <laughs> that sounds really cool. Like a major nerd haven. Do you know? Did it say where? It would be really uh, just, cool if it, it was just like, said Minneapolis. Okay. It would be cool if it was kind of on our side of of town. Because I feel I mean, like there's, all, there's cool a lot of that kind of stuff in like uptown. Or oh, it would suck if it was in Uptown. Yeah. I hope it's not in Uptown. Like, there's already so much down there. It'd be cool if it was, like, kind of closer to here. As long as it's somewhere easy to get to and not super far, mm -hmm. I'm down with like it. Like, somewhere we could, like, go. Yeah. Especially part of our posse, as it were. Yeah, it seems like a cool place to hang out and maybe partner up with mm -hmm. down the road. A lot of cool stuff like that here. Oh, Jesus. This is... No, don't you... Okay. <laughs> he was so close to killing me. Come on, Vaughn. Cap it. Cap it off. <laughs> Tap her off. Nice. <laughs> Got it. Come on, come on, come on. There's one guy. There's one guy in here. Oh, okay. you have to kill him before you can cap it? Yep. I'm gonna blow him up with the... Nope. The tank's gonna die. If the tank blows up while you're in it, do you lose? You die, yeah. Yeah. Ah! Come on! How would you God not cap it. it yet? It's if one enemy is in there, like they prevent it from. Oh, even going while any you've got it filled up. Yeah. God, that's ridiculous. So I had it pretty much all the way up, but then, ah, uh, no cigar. All right, you got it this time. Yes, this time, we got him, ladies and gentlemen. I still feel like this guy has a chance to be the best character. The Dark Trooper? Yeah. Situ yeah, in situations like this, where you just need to, like, clear it out, it's... he's... kind of... OP. His one disadvantage is he's like the sniper where he has less armor. Yeah, you so gotta he's, he's a little, make sure you don't take a lot of damage. Yeah, he's a little, uh... Squishy? Squishy. Yeah, that's exactly the word I was looking for. Thank you. Oh, is that a turret or a yeah. person? There's a guy. Was well, the guy in it? Oh, like the AI can. Uh, can well, you could do out. it too. You could cut that thing down. <laughs> All right, Paul Bunyan, that shit. How does God he even get up it. there? Uh, just like a normal turret, but no. But I mean, how does the person get up there on that top of that little light post? Um, to sit in that. Yeah, there's no ladder. Post. Yeah, there's no ladder. It's too small for an elevator. OSHA probably doesn't approve. <laughs> Hope he's got a commode up there. Yeah, I wonder if, does he, is he, uh, you know, he's got to be strapped in, tethered somewhere. Oh, in case he falls? Yeah. Let's see if we can blow him up. How yeah, there we go. Bye bye. Got him. Oh, they oh got and me. he got you. <laughs> Frack Gorshin. Yep. Some of the names are comical. Some of them sound like uh, Ratchet and Clank names, too. Oh, come on. What did we lose? 
You lost did again? We, we didn't lose, did we? Okay, we didn't lose. This is fine. Reinforcements are nearly exhausted. Ah, there's a tank. We're just gonna go in here. It's weird how people just stop chill. shooting at you. Oh, you can't cap while you're in the tank? Nope, but we're gonna... Make sure we kill them all. Can your other guys cap? Well, we already have it captured. We're just defending it right oh, now. Oh, nice. Yeah. See the timer on the right? We just have to hold it for... I see. ...that long. Until what? Um, until it gets down to 10, or to 0. But I mean, what happens it's after 10. it gets to 0? Then we'll... I think we have to go capture something else, probably. Oh, okay. You get to move on. Yeah, this is just... Like I see. Well, ...part of the objective. Okay, bring... ...the breaching bomb to the, the temple The breaching doors. bomb. That sounds serious. It does. I think we're storming the, the palace. Ooh. That's what your troopers do best. <laughs> is breach. Is storm. Oh yeah. We we are storm troopers. Come on, Wookie, get out of here. I was gonna say, can't you run people over? Alright. Jetpack. Nice. Boom. You like that? It's pretty good. Why was that located there? Get in the tank? Yes. Don't shoot me. Yes, yes. Alright, we're good. Careful. Careful. Oh. Nelly. Oh, why did you get out? Because I, if I, I was hoping I could just kind of skirt around it. Because so if you, the tank die, if the tank explodes while you're in it, you die. Right. So you got to go get that bomb again. Yep. But we got it. Yeah, dude, you're so fast. Got him. You're gonna blow up. To the, to the doors. Yes. I'm out. Oh, you got an award. Ugh. Damage reduction. So you just planted the bomb? I think so. Now it's timing down, and it'll, it'll explode. Boom! Yeah, get in. There they are. Oh, there they are. You picked up a gunner? It's them. Yep. Because then, my idea for that is that if, uh... Oh, baby! There's so many guys in here. Do you see <laughs> this? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> you got it, dude. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. Oh, you're definitely exploding. Well... My idea is that if I have a gunner, I can ask, I can like ask them to uh, to storm it. Well, no. Once I get out, they'll keep operating the the tank. So like, if I have to abandon ship, so there's someone to still drive it. Oh, I see. And like help me, I guess. I see. And they'll stay in until it explodes. Yep. And because I think I have to actually like go in the Jesus. I think I actually have to go in here. So yeah, what's your objective now? It's like there's like VIPs in here I have to kill. Oh okay. Yeah, I don't know if there are like bosses, but uh, stop, stop it, ow, please, <laughs> Jesus, there's too many. I gotta take a tank for sure. Oh yeah, just drive right so, in there, dude. Let's see. Where do they spawn? The tanks? Yeah. <coughs> um, here's one. Nice. Alright, let's get some guy. The heck are those? Weird birds. birds. Hop I've in, never buddy. seen those. There we go. Yeah! In we go. Yeah! Blow up those computers. Alright, you keep killing them. So he stays in there? Yep. Nice. If you, but if you didn't take a guy with you, they would just like, you know, abandon ship. Or it would just be an empty. Oh God, it's Bothans. <laughs> My worst nemesis. You remember those guys? Yes, the I do. The guy that killed you by that, poking you. Yes. Kill this guy. God. <laughs> he memed me. He did. He, he proed oh. you. He MLG'd you. <laughs> That's going to be on a, a highlight reel. Yeah. Made a mockery of you. <sighs> All right, and again. Oh, the tank guy's still going. <laughs> He's a legend. MVP. Get out of here! Get out of here! Jump! Oh, come on! All the recoil. Oh. Okay, there he is. Come on! Come on! Oh, got him! <laughs> With one left. Did we win? I think we won. Yes! Oh. Up top, Vaughn. Thank you. That was f not easy. Holy shit. Yeah, I'm, I'm like sweating a little bit. That seemed a little... Wow. A little crazy. 
Well, perfect timing because yeah, we, need to, first. we need to sign off here. That was a bit of a long one, Whew. but it was worth it. Yeah, shout outs to Minnesota 501st. Sure, yeah. <laughs> come and see us. Come visit the Chateau du Bois. We'll host you. Uh, we'll wreck you in Battlefront. Too. Next week on the show, we're going to have... Uh, it's a bounty hunter? Yeah, we're going to have me playing bounty hunter. Uh, in the meantime, on Wednesday, you can check out your boys with your boy Bracky. Ooh! <laughs> Playing some. What do you guys know about that? Playing some Zooter. <laughs> uh, is that the, is that the acronym? That's the acronym for the Zooter. Zelda Ocarina of Time randomizer. Zooter. Join us for that two way race. A lot of fun. Uh, and maybe an you episode guys, on Friday. I don't know. It's possible. It's possible. But uh, either way, just hang. Racky, come on. Yeah. You got to be there for that. Yep. And. Uh, Take care until then. Hit us up on Discord, Instagram, what have you. All that good stuff. Say hello. All those places. And uh, we'll see you in the next thing. Yeah. Bye-bye.